According Freddie Mac, home loan rates continue rise as the Federal Reserve points a more aggressive monetary policy. Combat inflation. According to Freddie Mac's primary mortgage market survey, the average rate for a 30-year flat rate mortgage rose to 6.73% for the week ended March 9. This is up from last week when it averaged 6.65%. One year ago it was also on average 3.85%. Meanwhile, the average 15-year fixed rate mortgage averaged 5.95% up from an average of 5.89% last week. This rate is much lower than a year ago, with an average of 3.09%. These increases in mortgage rates have come amid continued uncertainty about the pace of inflation, a high interest rate environment, and fears of an impending recession. However, home buyers can still find value when shopping for the best prices. If you're ready to own a home, researching the best mortgage rate can benefit you. You can visit Credible to compare options from different lenders at once without affecting your credit score. Mortgage insurance premiums on FHA loans will be downloaded in March Fed expects to continue. Raising interest rates in 2023 The Fed raises interest rates to reduce inflation. But while the move could lower spending and the rate of inflation, it could also affect rates for products like mortgages, which have climbed in recent weeks. Most recently, the Fed increased interest rates by 25 basis points in February. This was the second consecutive low interest rate hike, but Fed Chairman Jerome Powell said at a Senate panel Tuesday that rate hikes could heat up again. Amid a strong economy and high inflation, Recent economic data came in stronger than expected, indicating that the final level of interest rates will likely be higher than previously anticipated, Powell said, if all the data were to show that faster tightening was necessary, we would be prepared to accelerate the pace of rate hikes, although the rate of increase in inflation has slowed in recent months, it is still far from the Fed's 2% target. According to the Consumer Price Index, inflation increased by 6.4% yoy in January. However, this is still close to the June peak of 9.1%. If you want to take advantage of mortgage rates before they potentially increase, comparing rates now can help. You can visit Credible to get your personalized rate within minutes without affecting your credit. Score. Inflation. The reason for some homeowners do not have enough insurance to cover a disaster survey mortgage. Rates and housing prices expected to fall although mortgage rates continue to rise. Some experts say rates are near their peak. Almost 63% of economists and housing experts in a recent Zillow panel predicted that 30-year flat rate mortgages will peak in the first quarter of 2023. Also, 22% said mortgage rates will be the highest in Q2. Projected rates of around 6% or less are expected to peak in subsequent quarters. In addition, the panel said that housing prices are expected to decrease by 1.6% by December 2023. However, the panel predicted that house prices will rebound in 2024 and remain stable at an average clip of. 3.5% per year, and current home sales are projected to drop to 4.2 million in 2023. Zillow said that rate increased relative to the seasonally adjusted annual sales rates for November and December, but lower than the 5.0 million sales overall in 2022. The housing market is resetting, Zillow said. While we are seeing early signs of re-buyer interest earlier this year, prices will generally flatten out in 2023, helping buyers catch up. The large number of first-time homebuyers and a lack of inventory should be limited. After the recent ups and downs in home prices a return to more normal growth would be welcome. If you're a first-time home buyer looking to keep costs down, shopping for mortgage options can benefit you. You can visit Credible to speak with a mortgage professional and get answers to your questions.
Car and home insurance shopping increases after 2022 drops have a question about finance but don't know who to ask. The trusted money expert at Money Expert Credible and your question can be answered in our trusted money expert column.